Hey, welcome back to R. Today we're going to take a look at Monster Jam Jumbo Cards, Truckin' Pals. So, picked up a Dollar Tree, so they got them right now. So, if you like this kind of stuff, you can go pick it up. So, let's open it up, check it out. Alright, here we have the Monster Jam Truckin' Pals. Yeah, it's Gravedigger there on the cover. So, let's just open it up, check it out. So we have a Joker here, it's like a Dalmatian truck. And uh, Ace, I don't know, you have like a school, what was that, no, like a dump truck. Some kind of truck that's on fire, and like a Razorback. So I don't know who the Truckin' Pals are. Like if, <laughs> it's like it was a cartoon at some point in time, or maybe like, like a comic book or coloring book, I don't know. Uh, see. Not a fan, the Spider-Man ones had art on each card. I don't like when they do this. It's kind of cheap out. These have um, tire tracks here. It's easy to read. The numbers are nice with that outline in black. And it does look okay. But that means only the face cards are going to have the truck and pals on it. So here's your Jag. You got like a, maybe that's El Toro. Maybe, I kind of know him from the game. Um, don't know these guys. You know, like a Rottweiler and some kind of troll. And you have Gravedigger here, some kind of uh, like army jeep, maybe some kind of general Dalmatian again. Kind of a shark and pirate. And I'm not sure what this guy is. So that's not bad art on these. But that, that does suck that it's just the face cards. For a dollar, I can't really complain. I won't even say it's a ripoff because, I mean, they're the standard of these, like quality wise. The cards aren't super thin or super thick. And you do get some art. But yeah. And there should be another Joker. We're going to see if it's the same. Well, different Jokers. I do like different Jokers. And the back is this big Monster Jam Truck and Pals. So I'll look, I'll look this up, Truck and Pals, and see what it was. I'll let you guys know if it, what it was a cartoon or not. So this is 2020. So pretty recent. You know, not a bad pickup, I guess. If you like monster trucks. And for a dollar. Not the worst. Well, bonus, bonus triple R, Disney cards, again from the Dollar Tree for a dollar. So, let's see how these look. Got a goofy there. So, for the Joker. Mini Mouse or an Ace, and again, not gonna get art on the main cards. Just uh, this kind of standard Mickey Mouse looking firework kind of thing. Uh, it is nice. It looks like the the suits are gonna be different colors though of cards, so that's kind of cool. So in here, Eeyore, the Jack. Uh, I don't know who this is. Nice. Shere Khan, probably one of my favorite Disney characters is this guy. So yeah, that's cool. And then Mickey. So the face colors, face cars are gonna be different colors. All the standards are gonna be the same kind of blue and white. So yeah, it's all the same. Let's see here. Oh, some more characters. Okay. Piglet, Alice Cat, Bagheera. Arnold. Al. In. Blue. Heart set. Uh, we need a 
Poo, Cat, Mowgli. So, what makes this worth it to me is you put a Shere Khan card in here. I guess the only thing else you need would be a, maybe a Scar card. So that is the, the Disney set for a dollar, Jumbo cards. Be, like I said, both are made by Spin Master Games. I think they make most of these sets. And the back. So, not bad. Get your four characters on each back. dollar pickups they're not bad not bad at all just kind of like when you put art on each card let's see if being lazy and I think they ruffle shuffle pretty decently but let's see yeah so not bad thanks for watching triple R have a good day or night wherever you are <laughs>